Hello, folks. So we got another figure here. This is uh, by Rainbow as well. This is uh, Iron Princess Mask. <laughs> yes, Iron Princess Mask. Yeah, this villain was very bizarre. On the wiki, it says that it's actually... It was a female character, but it had a male, very deep, male, you know, voice. So, I don't know what the hell, maybe he's like, maybe he's in feminine, or a cross-dresser, I don't know. They do that in, in anime sometimes, where they have like a real effeminate, maybe gay character, but he, he's got like a, a voice, he's like, you know, I don't know. No, no, it's actually, sometimes they have kind of like, doo -doo 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 -doo. so I don't know, I don't know, but... Uh, anyway, so, yeah, this guy, he, um, uh, in this episode, um, the villains want to break into some lab of the Go Rangers, so they, um, they need, like, what was it, like, eight, six or eight, uh, rubies, so this guy goes around to different, um, jewelry stores robbing them, and... Then they thought, oh, well, maybe we'll also try and frame one of the Go Rangers for theft. So he dresses up as, like, I can't remember what. It was either the red, blue, or green ranger. And tries to frame him. And then, um, they quickly resolve that within ten minutes of the episode. So, less than ten minutes, probably. They're like, oh, it was just the Black Cross Army, so whatever. And uh, most, the neat thing about him, though, is most of his, uh, all of his minions, they carry pink umbrellas. Like this one here. And it, it doesn't have a, a machine gun in it, like Danny DeVito or anything, but, you know, he can whack him over the head with his <laughs> parasol. So, that's about it. But uh, this one has really, like, his head can really move around real good. And you can kind of see in the light here, it's very glossy. It even feels very glossy. So this is one of the few figures I have from Rainbow that are, are like, it's, it's very glossy and shiny and kind of soft to the touch, you know. It's, it's really kind of weird. So, and you can see the boots, on the, they, they look really shiny and compared to like, you know, a newer one. You can kind of see the difference, can't you? A little bit. It's not, not not as glossy. It's kind of weird. Yeah, it just has kind of a boring blue cape. But I'm thinking about down the road um, making some custom capes and just taking them all off and just giving them cloth capes and spray spray painting them and whatnot. Since I mean they're going to deteriorate down the road anyways, probably less than 10 years, they'll probably all rot off or whatever, so, but, uh, you can notice they, 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 uh, some of them have trouble standing, this one doesn't really have too much trouble standing, but I, I, what I found the trick is to get those little pad things at Walmart and just stick them on there, have a little adhesive, and then they, some of them, I mean, the newer ones, they don't stand worth shit, so, God, <laughs> like I said, <laughs> I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of iffy. So yeah. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the review. Stay tuned. i got more coming. Have a wonderful day and goodbye.